Today, we're reviewing how to answer these frequently asked F1 questions effectively. What is the purpose of your visit to the United States? Which university or college have you been accepted into? Have you applied to other universities? If so, which ones? Hey, Green Card Easy viewers. Are you pumped about studying in the United States but feeling a little anxious about your F1 visa interview? Don't worry, we've made it easy. We'll walk you through some essential tips for answering commonly asked F1 visa questions so you can confidently convince the visa officer to grant you your F1 visa. Did you know that one in every three F1 visa applicants was rejected last year? It's crucial to ace your US visa interview on the first try, as every rejection lowers your chances of getting a visa. Preparation is key to success. Don't leave your future up to chance. Our clients who've taken the advantage of our F1 visa interview consultation and mock F1 visa interview services boast more than a 99% approval rate. You can find the link in the description. Now let's dive into those frequently asked questions. What is the purpose of your visit to the United States? You likely face this question right at the start of your F1 visa interview. To answer this question effectively, let's understand the intent behind the question. The visa officers already know why you're there, but they want to see how well you can communicate. So let's set a positive tone and make a great impression. Here's what we suggest you do. Flash a warm smile. Greet the visa officer if you haven't already. A simple, good morning officer or Good afternoon, officer. We'll do the trick. Mention your program name. Name the university you'll be attending and specify that you're seeking an F1 visa. Keep it concise and friendly and always remember to smile. An ideal answer could be something like this. Good morning, officer. I've been accepted into the MBA program at the University of Texas and I'm here for my F1 visa interview. By sharing these essential details, you'll give the visa officer the background they're looking for while also avoiding unnecessary follow-up questions about your program and university. It'll help keep the conversation focused and on track. And hey, if you have any questions or concerns, feel free to head over to greencardeasy.com discussions for quick responses. The link is in the description. Now that you know how to effectively answer what is the purpose of your visit to the United States? You're one step closer to acing that interview. Stay tuned for more advice on the next question. Which university or college have you been accepted into? In your F1 visa interview, the visa officers might ask you about your planned course of study, primarily to confirm the details on your DS-160 and I-20 forms. No stress. Just use this chance to maintain a positive vibe by smiling and speaking clearly and confidently during the conversation. Here's how you can respond. I'm excited to pursue an MBA at the University of Texas. Or, I'm eager to attend the MBA program at the University of Texas. Make sure to keep it professional and avoid using slangs. Keep in mind that the program name on your I-20 may not exactly match your actual course name, and that's perfectly fine. The I-20 name corresponds to the classification of instructional programs or CIP code provided by the National Center of Education Statistics. When answering the visa officer, just refer to the program name as listed on your university's website. As you prepare for your F1 visa interview, it's a great idea to also get familiar with the US financial system. Trust me, starting now will help you save thousands of dollars and set you on the path to long-term wealth. To help you out, we've created a personal finance for immigrants YouTube playlist. The link is in the description. All right, let's move on to the next question and keep this momentum going. Have you applied to other universities? If so, which ones? During your F1 visa interview, the visa officer might ask, have you applied to other universities? If so, which ones? 
This question is important, so let us help you navigate it like a pro. Visa officers want to ensure you're a genuine student and not attempting visa fraud, such as immigrating to the United States under false pretenses. So let's focus on answering their question effectively. First, pay close attention to the question. If they only ask, have you applied to other universities? Remember, it's a yes, no question. They don't want to know specifics about other universities. Respond accordingly, such as, yes, I applied to seven other universities, or I applied to a total of eight universities. If you didn't apply to other universities, make sure to explain your reasoning to show your genuine intentions. A great answer could be, I didn't apply to other universities because I was very selective when choosing which schools to apply to. Be prepared for a follow-up question asking you to explain your reasoning. Speak about the program specifics, any conversations with professors, or other course-related reasons you may have. Remember, genuine students typically apply to multiple universities, so this question works to your advantage. If you found this advice helpful, like this video and subscribe to our channel for more valuable tips. We share updates and different content on Instagram and Facebook, so follow us there too. My name is Gaurav Musle, and from all of us at Green Card Easy, thanks for watching.